hello guys it's me again and in today's video it's gonna be a short video tutorial and i'm going to show you how we can install flutter on intel based mac also the same thing goes on to the m m the arm max the m1 to m4 so what you need to do you need to first of all you need to have android studio and you need to download the flutter application for you can just download the if you you can install it from here you can download and install the mac flutter mac os zip so i've just downloaded it right here and what you need to do you need to ex extract it sorry or expand it and let me show you if you flutter doctor you see command is not found so let's wait for it to finish with the expansion so there we go it is done and what you need to do let me minimize this open your I like to put it here on the developer folder but you can put it where you want so mine I'll just need to be in that in this part so I'll just drag it here uh, and also my Android studio right here let me show you this is my Android studio and again if I go to and then click on flutter doctor as you can see there so let me go to the you can see right here you need to unzip it and then you need to add this part to your z z s dot env but what made me make this video this this dot s h h n v is not i didn't get enough with it so i'm going to show you how you can just add it to your so just copy this one and open your text editor paste it there and then also you need to get info from where and then this is where our path is our flutter part so i already know this one so you can you can also like if you want to see the path you can just drag it here and then it will show you the path so let me just close this one and then you need to need to be in bin so if you drag it here copy this one close it and then come here and like so and then paste it there and don't forget to add the semicolon from here and here so copy it and the next thing we need to do we need to show the hidden files for your max so what you need to do you need to hold command shift and then dot or full stop and then it will bring you something like this what you need to look for is this zp z profile so open it with text editor and then you can just add something like flutter path and then just paste what you have just copied like so and then save it close this one so let's flutter doctor and boom 
we can see our flutter is working and let's wait for it Okay, so there we go. You can see now our flutter is working and you can just use it anywhere or any wherever we want it. So that is it for this short video. And if you are not subscribed to the channel, please hit the subscribe button and I'll see you in the upper event. So